raspberry creamer. All the rich, creamy taste of half and half, but 75% less saturated fat and no cholesterol in coffee, over fruit, or cereal. Coffee Mate Liquid is a smart new way to have a taste you like. Without the fat and cholesterol, you don't. Rich, creamy, and smart. New Coffee Mate Liquid from Carnation in your grocer's dairy case. The skies over Colorado can be beautiful. They can also be dangerous. You should be ready for whatever nature throws at you. Channel 9 is leading the way in weather information and weather preparedness. For your safety, for your information, Dave Sweeney, Bill Custer, Cliff Nicholson, Nick Carter. Operation Weather Ready. Rosemary Collins joins Ward Lucas weekends beginning April 15th. From KUSA in Denver, this is Nine News, number one in Colorado. The mountains tell the story of fresh blanket of snow in April. It's the stuff Colorado winters are made of. The spring sunshine already at work will see a big difference by the end of the day. Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mark Cobra. And I am Sylvia Jennings for Linda Benzel. The last 24 hours have been tough for area motorists. The wet snow and freezing overnight temperatures created some treacherous driving conditions during rush hour. On I-70 this morning, a section of highway from Morrison to Genesee was closed to eastbound traffic because of a series of wrecks. There were six separate accidents involving eight cars. Two people were treated for minor injuries. Also this morning, a mother and three children were airlifted from the scene of an accident in Conifer. She is in critical condition. The children are listed in fair condition. Overnight, the slippery streets caused a rash of bad accidents. Seventeen people were sent to Denver General Hospital alone. One woman was actually in two wrecks. Kelly Tippett pulled over on West Alameda to exchange information after one accident when she was hit by an oncoming car. The driver apparently couldn't stop in time because of the ice. Tippett was treated and released. A 15-car pileup closed westbound I-70 at the airport tunnel yesterday.